All right, that's one exit down. That's one. Okay. That wasn't so bad. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> I, add, I added more, and it's 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 okay. I actually really like it. I'm a fan of of milk, so. <laughs> Well, it says, actually, I read the box the bottle again. It said it's for milkshakes, add to eight ounces of milk. So, we're not making milkshakes, we're just drinking coffee milk. I'm sure that's how they, they, they use it. It sounds milk. like how she was intending us to, to, to drink it. I mean, do you, you have ice cream, right? I have chocolate ice cream. You want to make chocolate coffee milkshakes? No, because I like the ice cream as it is. <laughs> wow. Someone's sour on the... Uh... I agree though, you vanilla's unless you're making a strawberry milkshake. Oh no, I mean it, it's chocolate with like little chocolate truffles in it. Oh, so. okay, it's the fancy briar kind, right? Yeah, it was on sale for two fifty. Oh yeah, it always goes on sale for like half off. Yeah. Around this time. Or around every once in a while. Even in even in the cold place of my homeland, it goes on sale for half price in the middle of winter, no one knows why. It's ice cream. Yeah, but even then it goes it usually goes on sale in the summer as well. Well, it just skips spring and fall. Well, it's like, you think about ice cream. You guys got Dairy Queens? Yeah. Okay. Well, I don't know. You don't have, like, Cheez-Its. <laughs> no, we don't. So I gotta ask these things. We have Carl's Jr. It's weird to see Hardy's signs with the same logo here. I think in some places we get Carl's Jr. It yeah, depends it, on it, where you are. Yeah, it, for, for America, it's like one side of the country gets one, the other gets the other. And then in Canada, it's just Carl's Jr. <laughs> <laughs> Why did you do that to yourself? Because I need the extra hit. Alright. I don't like this one bit. Man, Abstract World was being so kind to us. With all its floating bubbles and weird you know, night shit. You know, this, this, this actually, I realize what this reminds me of. This what? tastes like a white Russian. Oh, yeah. But without the alcohol in it. We just made non-alcoholic white Russians. Or kind of like, kind of like a paralyzer. I don't know that one. Um, Pepsi, um, vodka or tequila and milk. It doesn't curdle if you mix it right. That's the trick. That sounds terrible. It tastes kind of like this though. That still sounds terrible. Pepsi, vodka, and milk. You have to, it's, it's called a paralyzer, and you have to mix it right. That's the thing. There's a trick to it. <laughs> You're never gonna hit that guy with a shell. Neither are you. <laughs> I know. You're distracted by my weird drinks. I'm gonna go look, I'm gonna go look it up. Look sure. up what, a paralyzer? Make sure I'm right about this. Ah, damn, I almost had it. I got hit again. You could also just, like, probably do Paralyze or Drink. Oh, yeah, coffee liqueur, so Bailey's, that's what was missing. Okay, that's... So that's why it tastes like that. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> but yeah, if you mix it right, it doesn't curdle. Why are those so solid? <laughs> <laughs> There's a big red bar on Audacity right now. You want me to take back over? The worst part about this is that we're not even at a midpoint. There might not be a midpoint. There might not be, but that's still, like, this point where we're at right now feels like there should be a midpoint. Before the auto-scroll? Yeah. Yeah, I agree. Unless there is one there and we just don't see it because it's for invisible or something. <laughs> it looks... it looks like a springboard! <laughs> oh my god. Nice jump. Nice, nice assist, Chuck. So that's that's coin two. Coin three is in the other thing. So that should be the midpoint. I mean, maybe it's one screen after that, but actually, yeah, it looks like looks like the midpoint should be right there. You see, there's a tiny block sitting over on yeah. that side. So we might just be missing the actual midpoint because we don't know what the fuck it looks like. I mean, maybe. 
but there's nothing to suggest that either. If you get too close to the back, it doesn't seem very... That's solid. Oh, shit. Ugh. That bomb's not Where a bomb. Where do I go? This level does not very kind to Big Mario. And every time I gotta come back through this... I'm considering dropping a state at the, uh... Where the midpoint you think should be? Yeah. Just because, like... We gotta be missing something. I don't know. I mean, maybe we're not missing something, but it's just such a long... Slog to get back? Yeah. I mean, this front part isn't even that much of a slog anymore. Not... At this point, we've died enough times to... Have it kind of memorized. Yeah, but it's just... Why? I don't know, it's not... Particularly interesting. The sprite bits were the God damn it. I was really hoping to go into this with a with a second power up. Maybe it'd be better to just be small Mario. I mean maybe. Is there a way to clip through a wall with a No. Hmm. Nice glitch coins. Oof. if you're small Mario, you can just go down there. You don't have to... No, but that doesn't even seem better. Yeah, the Goombas are, are bombs. You gotta be small for this. Oh, damn it. I didn't... I was, I was expecting to keep going along with the platform. Yeah, I'm not a I'm not a fan of multi again multi variable scrolling at all. It's the crux of a lot of levels that rely on L and R scrolling and these weird auto scrollers. It's like one thing to have a, a solid thing that you that moves along with you. It's another to have things just kind of traveling at different paces because they li they end up lining up really funny sometimes. I'm gonna I'm gonna put a safe state down at the at the thing, okay. regardless of what's if I'm large or small, Mario. That's fine. <laughs> Fancy jumps again. <laughs> oh, I despawned one of them. Convenient. Expecting that. All right. I never remember what the hotkey is. I think it's just Shift F1. It doesn't matter. Good luck getting that without... I shouldn't have survived there. No. You're on the ship a bit early now. Yeah, but I gotta deal with... Our friend Mr. Goomba. I think. He flipped upside down when you stomped on him. He had to be a Goomba. Oh. Is that it? Why, but why so... Oh no. Bullet generator. Nice. <laughs> but why so, like... That's... It's such a shift. It's it's a shift. It's harder than the other... The, front, the first bit, meaning you have to go through the first bit so much. And... 
Oh god. Um, I, I just need to catch it on the way up. Alright, that's fine. Coaster, please. It is stuck to the... <laughs> is yours stuck to the bottom? Yes, no, it, it yes, has been. I've been has, sliding it off. I don't have another napkin over here to... I want me to um, trumpet away from the mic a bit. I slid it with my hand. You did it. That thing that Trump does for some reason. Alright, so... We got a bullet generator occurring. I have to catch this on the up, but not too up. Oh! Yay! Moving... moving layer two wa water bubbles. That's not that bad. Not as bad as climbing stuff. No, climbing is the worst because the Mario does not move with the net. There's Dragon Coin Numero Trio. That's such a small segment too. And then, oh. Oh God, what was that? Oh no, there's a Lakitu above An us. An off-screen Lakitu. An off-screen Lakitu, so I can't even see where he's dropping his stuff. Why? Why would you replace everything else? <laughs> Leave the fish the same. I don't get it. I feel like there's more than one of him. He seems to be dropping faster than I remember. Also, this is weird to, like, interpret. Oh, at least the sprite replacement makes sense. But I don't like him being off screen. He should not be off screen. You can't tell when he's throwing. Or screen, where he's throwing. Off screen Lakitu is the, like, number one complaint. About early game Mario World Central Protection. I don't even remember when that was an instance. Level two. <laughs> Someone the, the 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 balance team decided to add a Lakitu to level two because it was pretty empty and plain. And they put it off screen. And then you can you can get his cloud towards the end and fly <laughs> fly over stuff that you're not supposed to fly over. Because they threw it in there after that and decided not to test any bugs. And uh, added munchers to level one. Yeah. Because... why? Because it's a Mario World Central game, they gotta put munchers everywhere. Like this level did, they just turned them into dolphin butts. To be fair, those could be spikes if we're using the castle tile set. They are actually different. Spikes don't turn into coins when you hit a silver pea. Yeah, but functionally... They both hurt you when you touch them. Yep. I just don't get all these little short segments. What's to the right? Oh, there is a... Well... Yay! Uh... This, that's the downside to um, Infinite Lives, is getting a 1-up like that never feels good. <laughs> it's not good if you- I mean, okay. A 1-up in a situation like that isn't worth it. If you make your 1-ups not worth it to get, then what's the point of the 1-up? I almost feel like the um, the the creator played the level once and didn't consider a, a, a balance pass or anything. They're like, "Yep, I beat it." It's I was good trying enough. to I was trying to rush the lack of two because, of course, you're gonna beat it. You know where everything is. But it, I mean, I can't I can't understand like why you have such a tiny segment. And then another tiny yeah. segment? No, 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 no. Uh, I meant what I meant by tiny segment was a se that segment where the auto scroll, where Mario has to like go in between those little bits and being big, even though you give him a power up or the option of one. Like, why you would make that such a claustrophobic area? I just don't know why they thought an off-screen Lakitu was a good idea. Or that, like. You might know where stuff is, but you still don't know where the Lakitu's throwing stuff. It's not consistent. I've, I've messed with the sprite before. The, and half the time, the, fu the fireballs aren't spawning. Well, 
but like here and stuff, it's like, well, what do what, I? Yeah, what do you do? He's throwing them very oh. fast. There's got to be two up there. No, there's only one. Is it based off of some map? I, no, I don't think so. I think he's throwing them at a regular speed. It just feels fast to us. Because it's we're moving slower, right? I don't know. I just think it's he's moving at the right speed. It's just. What if it happens if I start select? I don't know. I don't want it to reset our progress. No. Want me to take a crack at it? All right, sure. Let's let's let me bash my head against it for a couple minutes. To finish your. I your finished coffee my milk. coffee milk. I thought you would have finished it, but by, by now. You gotta fat, you gotta hit know, it on the upswing. It's just the bullet generator is it got in my way. Yeah, the third one. I just ran off the edge there. I tried to jump. Pro tip, don't don't use the generators. Just don't. <laughs> My humble opinion. The fish one's bad, the bullet jump one's down. real bad. If you jump about the time that the second bullet passes into your feet, maybe a split second after that, you'll get on yeah. the platform and you can avoid the... the and I think the only reason they're consistent is because... Because we've died. They're now seated, technically. Yeah. If you if you get here without the midpoint, they'd be completely random no. still. Yeah, I knew he was coming. Oh my god! <laughs> All, right. All right. When you get onto the to the pokey uh, to the the Wiggler train, just um stay on it for uh, uh, for a couple bounces so that that oh uh, never mind. He left. Bye. <laughs> he decided I'm done with this shit. Whoa! Oh, I'm trying to dodge them, but I don't know where they're coming from. It's fun. I'm surprised this level isn't rated a bit lower because of that Lakitu, specifically. It's off-screen. It, it's frustrating. It might... Well, I mean, there's only so many points you can deduct for something. Yeah. I mean, the level is what? It's like in the... Is it in the 50s? The yeah. 60s, is it, 50s? it was rated mid by all judges. Well, they could have all had their own share of things Nitpicks. they did not like with it. Yeah. I'm not a fan of its... Oh my god, I hate those fires so much. I, I'm not a fan of the perceived length. No, you gotta stay on I, him I, for... The problem is, if I do, he'll walk off. No, 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 no. I think you hit him right on, like, the edge when he was turning around, and therefore he fell, because we really paces mm -hmm. back and forth. Yeah. Yeah, this is very long, too. It feels it. I don't think it actually is if you go front to st front, uh, start to finish, but it feels long. It feels long, and the variety of challenges that are in here don't build on each other. Yeah, they're they're different for, like, every section. The first one has a lot of note blocks, the second one's claustrophobic, the third one's got a bullet generator, and the fourth one's got a random lack of two and jumping fires. Like... Oh, man, I waited too long now, so... No, you're hard. okay, you're okay. Like, one thing... Second I've, jump I've, on him, second yeah. jump. Oh my god. You didn't help. I didn't. But one thing I've mentioned a lot is when I make a Mario level, I like to pick a set of sprites and stick with it. Uh, that's that's how you should do it. You you choose. It keeps your theme consistent. It's so dumb. <sighs> is there a way to bring a shell and just kill that fucker? No, there's nothing to pick up. I'm gonna try and kill him. I don't know how. There's nowhere and, to jump up. And to if I get the cloud and I go over the level, well, so you, be it. I don't care. If you kill him, well, if you jump on him, the thing goes away. You gotta throw something at him. I haven't seen a oh, single right, throwable yeah. object. Because they don't want you flying over their level, but they put a Lakitu in there. Well, that wasn't how I expected you to die there. Well, I expected to hit the bullet. I expected you to just fall in the pit right then. Well, I panicked because I thought I was going to hit the bullet. <laughs> And this is frustrating, because this section, you have to wait. And, like, it just feels, a lot of this feels very unnecessary. Yeah, like, I don't need this introduction segment to get into the Lakitu part. 
Like, I feel like you could- Cut out this in the auto-scroll. Yeah. And then just have the Lakitu be the twist on your setup in part one. But put him on screen next time, please. Yeah, don't- there's no need to have this span the whole vertical- I got a power vertical up! Vertical movement and stuff. Well, you had the power up, and then you just have to survive on the pokey for a, a jump or two. Alright. Watch out, he's coming right- God! In your jump. Damn it! I don't like this at all. We've been here- how long have we been here? I, I want to say that we've been doing this one I'm for about uh, over a half hour. Uh -huh. We keep encountering these. Um, the unfortunate one part is the last one was just kind of long because it was a puzzle level. The first one was long because it wasn't- Good. This one is- I'm gonna be blunt. <laughs> this one is long- Because- I don't know. It's- It doesn't feel like it should be this long. It's not like- why are all the power-ups in the, like, right before that, in, like, in oh, that Oh, come weird, on, lands right on me. In that weird auto-scroll section, basically. Because there's one right before it. No, then, not No, even. there's there's one on the spinning thing, then you get one in it. Well, that one on the spinning thing is, is earlier in the first segment. But still, like, and then there's nothing up until you get to the Lakitu part. Yeah. Well, you didn't get a power-up until, like, three or four screens in on the, uh, the first part, either. There is some sentiments I disagree with on Mario World Central about difficulty and power-up placement. I, I, I know I'm very generous with my power-ups, I'm very generous with coins, but... I feel like the player shouldn't go too long without a power. -up. Like the only one I, I'll dispute. Okay, there's on. two up there. They were very. No, I think it's because I froze the time with the uh, the picking up the power up or something like oh, that. All right, global know. timers. I guess he's a global. I did that with a charge and chuck by pausing once, and I got kicked with two footballs like immediately. I don't think you can get him there. I don't think so. You. I gotta avoid the spinies oh, now. Shit. Congrats! Your level's bad. But you gotta jump off. Oh shit! Yes! You killed him! But he might come back. He will come back very quickly. Lakitu does not stay dead in this game very long. Okay, that's interesting. Using the fires with the water like that, that's interesting. I'll give you that. Whoa. Soap water. Oh, oh god. Go, go, go. <laughs> uh, fuck that. Yep. Fuck that. <laughs> that was not fun. But it's, you see, it's not a very long level. When you look at the whole thing, from it's start short. to finish, it's short. But it's just, it's short and... But grueling. And, and, yeah, and, and not in a good in a good way. Like, you can have a short, difficult, difficult yeah. level. But that did not feel like the way to do it. Oh, hell no. It was just... It's just too... Like, you, you said... Was it this level or was it the last one of the Super Meat Boy Challenge? It was the last yeah. one. Yeah. But, it, it still kind of feels like that. You got these weird difficulty spike <laughs> segments. I mean, the Lakitu you can retry relatively quickly, but... But, like, the bullet bill left moored moving segment didn't add anything. And the no. auto-scroll didn't add anything either, they other did. than some weird scrolling like, mechanisms and I, stuff when, like that. I don't know. When I was playing the first part, I expected the second part to involve... Note blocks and glitches with the, the swinging platforms. And you gave me an auto-scroller, you gave me a rising and falling layer 2, and a Lakitu swimming level. There were four separate level ideas that were, in there. That were incredibly disconnected, other Some than... Some of them were barely expanded upon at all. Other than the weird sprite replacements. That's the only running theme through the level, so if you oh, take away... Oh, and we forgot the secret exit, which is the whole swimming Swimming segment. with the Porky so there's, Puffers there's and Rip five, Vanish. There's five distinct ideas in this level. Yeah. And the only unifying thing is the is the graphical replacement. And if you took part. them away, it would be... Just a mash of weird yeah. design. Hmm. I don't know. You want to go to cubes? I do. <laughs> uh. Cubes!